You're not getting any M and M's, guy. This it's is not so fucked up. No, it's not happening. I this actually is... agree with Eddie on this. Thank you. What? Really? He needs, to, he needs to set some precedent. Yeah. Really? I need to, I don't there has him. to be some house rules here. I Thank you. I agree. So. They're sitting there in a weird container, by the way, yeah. with little all, chicks fuck, on it. Fuck you is it Easter? for saying that. <laughs> is it Easter? I got it for Easter. A container, like a little plastic container, which ended up being perfect yep. to hold some little snacks that I have in I don't, here in my room. Eddie, I don't blame you. I wouldn't want everyone's hands in there grabbing no, them. No, fuck that. Fuck I get that. that. I get that. But there's this jar of peanut M&Ms that has been sitting here all staring week. Staring you right just in Just like huh? staring in yeah. my face. And I love it. It's great. When I'm gaming, just reach over every once in a while, have a couple of peanut M&Ms. Wow. Delightful. Dude. And you know what? <laughs> if it was some candy in there that Thor liked, yeah. he'd be pissed that he oh, couldn't yeah. have one. All I don't think it. so. I respect oh, it. Thank now, you. now so if stupid. if if it was like little bite size steroids, I mean, I was no, no. I was like <laughs> syringes. <laughs> if it was like little bite size what? Twix or Three Musketeers or fucking Milky Way, then I'd be like, why can't we have one? It's covered in wrapper. Because they're wrapped, right? Yeah, oh. but they're also mine. You know, well, fuck you guys. What Ooh. I offered, because it's a Friday, <laughs> I'm just having yeah. my last sips of coffee. Ew, I, you poured that at 5.30 this morning. So, so gross. Okay. You're so gross. gross. So not, gross. You're you honestly, you're gross. You're fucked yeah. up. You're fucking gross. So <laughs> what I'm suggesting is that Eddie could just dole one out. We don't have to put our hands in. You could pick so the you color. you want me to touch I don't want it. I, I don't really want Eddie to touch yeah. it. Yeah. See? So you could do that, Scott. And Emily cannot fit her hand in that jar. Excuse me. These are all problems. So it's all off the table. All right, I guess we'll now start the podcast Lame. we ain't done yet it's time for the p1 podcast fun's not over yet completely uncensored and un filtered except for that part looking for the after party with no the show's after show starts now i feel like i've given enough you know, I make you coffee yeah. every day. It's delightful. I make sure you're you have a mug over here, mm-hmm. every a clean one every single yeah. day. That's yeah, nice. I'm supplying the fucking toilet paper, That's yeah. the electricity, That's the sorry water. About, sorry about my spoon faux pas this morning. Yes, yeah, <gasps> we have the one spoon that we uh, use. I'm sorry. Why'd you bring that up against guys? And, well, I... and you know, we all use it to stir our coffee with. And then this dipshit leaves it in her coffee mug yeah. and just drinking Dip. out of it. Just drinking it, out of it. it. What's it's what I do at up, home? Man. They're taking advantage of you, Eddie. It's crazy. Okay, really? <laughs> there. What, I don't use any with coffee. What there? You, I don't use excuse any Excuse me. With what you did to this bathroom today, you're taking advantage <gasps> okay. of fucking well, all of us. Oh, all, Sky. All all great us. point. Okay. First of all, I'm on antibiotics right now. Okay. So okay. that's my okay. issue. Second, I said I would bring toilet paper on Monday. Uh, but still, what we had to if I remember. what we had to witness today, what we had to hear today. Thank I you. was farting like fucking. No, you we weren't farting. There. We heard. We you guys, we heard. Heard. you were having you mass diarrhea. It. We're trying to be respectful. We we're trying to be cool. My I, ass was I didn't want to be respectful. Yeah. I wanted to fucking say something. Dude, my I was, ass is raw right now, dude. It's because of the antibiotics. I gotta stop yeah, taking I, it. It I, sucks. I don't, don't want to hear about it anymore. Me uh, I, I've also given you guys all fruit. So oh, that's a delight. The fact that I am not willing to share my peanut M and M's, I think, is okay. Well, I think you should put them away. I'm not going to. This is where I, I spend my time. Well, yeah, you can take them out after we leave, but you're fucking Fuck teasing that. us. No, it's like me bring walking, your own. It's like me walking around my house in lingerie and not letting my husband hit it. That's fucked up. I feel like you do how that. Could any, <laughs> man, sky and lingerie, yeah. how could anyone keep their hands well, off look, of Listen to what you're wearing right now. I'm just saying. <laughs> how will you be able to resist this outfit? Well, th- you don't know. If <laughs> Seven I was, sweaters, nerd pajama bottoms. If I was just sitting here in the sports bra and these sweet nerd PJ bottoms, <laughs> hot. Hot. I disagree. <laughs> Look at I'm gonna space. disagree. Hot. Well, we've been talking a lot <laughs> about self pleasure. It's on our minds a lot because yeah. you know everybody's home. Uh, it's just not convenient. We're not getting our alone time. What did you say right before we started our podcast? I really hope that my family leaves at some point this weekend <laughs> so that I can have some alone time. <laughs> we're supposed to, remember, we're supposed to be yeah, staying home. Remember yeah, that? Yeah. But you could go for a walk or just something. Just a real mm-hmm. long walk. Oh, fucking, seriously, dude, walk to your house. <laughs> Wait, Boy, uh, all the way to the ocean? I don't give a shit, man. <laughs> God. I need to, actually, it won't take that long. I'm so backed up. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I hope they go do something. Go to a park or something yeah. can you even go to a park i don't yeah, even know I don't, I don't think you can. fuck oh, but man. yeah it's it's been <laughs> rough man no alone time no self-pleasure time mm-hmm. um so much so and, and the fact that we are home and have so much time on our hands apparently sales in one particular area is on the rise yeah the uh sex toy website oh. adam and eve just mm. put out some very familiar with oh it. yeah oh sure. are you, you're yeah. all familiar with mm-hmm. the adam yeah and eve. of course oh okay my bad back in the day sky they used yes. to be a sponsor 
of our show when we had a very different type of a show. Oh, yeah. And they would send out like catalogs. Oh, nice. All kinds of crazy shit. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's okay. A catalog. That's interesting. So, uh, Adam and Eve, let us know <laughs> that they're. <laughs> well, yeah, I have a lot interesting, of questions. Interesting, huh? Well, oh, Adam a, and Eve. Catalog. Oh, okay. What's a catalog. So, that's interesting. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, okay. Yeah. Catalog. What's that's, so that's interesting, interesting about yeah. it? <laughs> well, does the cat is the catalog <laughs> pornographic <laughs> or does it just show the product or does it actually show somebody <laughs> using the product? Okay, that's interesting. Uh, it doesn't show anybody <laughs> using the product. Product, but of course, they use hot models to like hold, hold it. it and things like yeah. that. Do they have like, it, the it, it like, like if there was, hmm. if there was like a dildo with some balls on it, would they show like in a mouth? No, not um, nothing. Of like course, that. he has to think of that. Well, because Sky was. Wondering. Do they make dildos with balls on them? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Why do we want? I had forget how offended Emily when I was. Is. That's how almost. <laughs> Like the rubber ones that don't have like dildos mechanics are on not it. Vibrators, like, guy. This is like there's they have you know, suction dildo, cups you know on the them, so but why you know do the we, oh, I, I do, but why do we want the balls on them? As a lady, oh, why do we Sky. want the balls on them? Because it hits you in good spots. Oh, if you have it like yeah, reverse? use it as a strap on. What? It just, no. No. Wait. Where is it hitting me? That oh, I like. God, where do I like I, the balls to hit? Now where? Nowhere. Okay. Your taint. Just give up. <laughs> oh, I do. I didn't know that, Emily. Emily's a big taint ball. Okay. Side. Yeah. All right. Okay. To each it's their nice, own. It's nice when you have a good slap of the balls. Uh huh. When, when, when they're really going at it. Oh, you gotta hear that. Or you know, if, <laughs> if you go from behind, then it will hit your your mm -hmm. little button there. There you go. You okay. Know? It was mm -hmm. like that. Yep. Okay. All right. These are all correct. We're, we're all, I we're love all... that we're teaching Sky about <laughs> balls and sex. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're all learning a lot today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, yes, Adam and Eve, the sex toy company, says, dude, the business is crazy right Boom. now. Mm -hmm. Booming with people wow. ordering sex toys just to their Emily. home. <laughs> they say just looking at the last week's numbers, comparing them to the same time in 2019, they have a 30% day over day increase wow. in the amount of sex toys <laughs> they're selling. Um, some of their top sellers include the Satisfier Pro 2 Vibrator. Mm -hmm. Got it. Tell me more. Thank you. Yep, yep. The Adam and Eve G Spot Vibrator. Okay. And of course, coming in third place, a classic is the Rabbit Vibrator. Uh, oh, yes. that was. I thought you were going to go like uh, Benoit balls or something. Mm, no, <laughs> no. But they do say that there's been a massive uptick in couples rings, the vibrating rings oh, the cock mm -hmm. that the guy. Well, what about well, um, like uh, anything weird on there? Like, well, I'm surprised penis pumps weren't on would, the list. Like, what do you mean? Like a butt plug or something? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I you know? don't. I mean, mm. they only told the top sellers. They didn't. So that's what I'm saying. Anywhere, so it's not. No, on no. I just told you all the top sellers. Those three uh, toys for women, all vibrators, Thor and needs then more. and then the couples. <laughs> he needs ring. a butt plug. I don't. Yeah. No, I don't need a butt. No, My butt. Why, does not why need would a he have asked if he didn't want it? <laughs> you need a butt plug. Actually, you actually need a cork. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Massive cork. Yeah. So sales are way up. So I guess it's a good business to be in these days. Oh. Emily, didn't you say you uh, self-pleasured on like Wednesday? Yep, on Wednesday. I used my trusty old little... Um, silver bullet? Little silver bullet. I don't really use anything else at all. I have a really? drawer full of other like, stuff. Yeah, you got like extreme ones from Dr. Sadie Allison. Yeah, no, I always think like I'll do that and then when it, the time comes, I'm like, no, I'm you just going to stick. You already know you're guaranteed. I'm going to stick with what I know and love. Now, hmm. that's because your man Robert takes Reed Tell Centro for the day. Yeah. And uh, that's what they're doing today, too. So will today be another oh, um, visit? You're wearing a pretty dress. Oh. Look at you. <laughs> um, maybe you get romanced by the bullet. Oh. oh it like brings a little you flowers. flowers. I don't know. Yeah. That, that's all a possibility. Yeah. Uh, I'm not really sure yet. Are you not feeling I, it yet? No, I don't really usually feel it until I'm like at home relaxing and then I might, you know, see something that makes me a little here's, excited. Here's what I want you to do right oh, before go. you, mm. you know, lay down to, to have your moment. Mm -hmm. I would like to, you to think about oh the noises that Thor was oh, making was so in the bathroom. Bad. Fuck it you, Eddie. So I can't believe you guys didn't say anything. Fuck you, That's Eddie. That's pretty crazy that you guys it's went the whole lot. fucking morning yeah. show without saying something. Because it happened like three different times. I thought, I thought, <laughs> oh man. It was man, explosive, the, I thought, oh, I thought, oh, it was no, no, no. It was I like, thought the... <laughs> 
It was bad. Yeah, was I thought the fan, I'm like, man, this fucking fan no. is covering up this noise. Are so, you serious? You really thought you were like, oh, this is good. I, I can't believe you guys didn't say anything. No. Well, like, I'm shocked by that. <laughs> when you were in there and we would hear the noise, we would all silent laugh and look at each other and like like giggle like we're oh. all little fucking children. Yeah. Uh, but, but we were trying to be cool because we didn't want to embarrass you because we oh, knew you're having some, some issues right I would, now. I honestly wouldn't have been embarrassed. Oh, wow. Well, really? I, we, I, I would be. I would be. If, I would have, yeah. if you would have heard what we heard, oh. you would be embarrassed. Oh, yeah. It was too much. It was I'm too shocked <laughs> that when I walked out of there, nobody went, you all right, dude? You, uh, uh, we I think I cool. did. I think I said that one time when... Yeah, I, mean, I told was, you, I, it's these antibiotics. I don't know if I should keep taking them. Okay, I have a day I left. I don't want to hear my brains out. I got nothing left. <laughs> I got nothing out. I, know, I don't think you would oh after my. hearing all that. Yeah, that's fucking gross, dude. Uh, well, on top of all of this, you know, people still want to get their sex stuff, mm -hmm. their sex on. Oh, yeah. I guess one sex shop was still doing great business, but of course with the stay-at-home order, they're getting shut down. Yeah, so, uh, you know, restaurants have to close, but you can still do takeout, only essential business. But what we've heard that we and what we've just seen out there in the world is a lot of businesses are trying to stay open, especially like we just talked about with this study, when customers are still really wanting your product mm -hmm. and even wanting it more than ever. Right. So in Illinois, this one sex shop has made news because they thought they had a genius idea of doing curbside takeout for sex toys. Oh, I, I'm I'm not really sure how that works. What do you mean? Well, yeah. you've been to Outback Steakhouse or Chili's sure. or one of those places. So you sure. place your order online. Uh -huh. You pull up and Curbside. they run out to your car, the bag of goodies. You swipe your card and you are on your way. Uh -huh. That's really that weird. sounds perfect. I'm already That's kind of ashamed perfect. going into a sex shop. I can't imagine doing curbside pickup. No, they probably, probably put it in a brown bag. They probably put it in a brown bag. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah. You've been in one? A couple. A couple. Mm -hmm. Like what are we talking about? Like just to like get something. Like what? Like what? Like um, I don't know. What's a? I've been to the Hustler store downtown. Yeah. Oh. F Street. F Street. I've been to F Street. Um, what are we buying? Uh, just I don't know. Like I was buying like sexy lingerie for my girlfriend at the time, or like I wanted to see what they had rather than ordering it online. Stuff kind of stuff. I actually have a funny story, and I don't want to say it on the air. But I guess I have to now. Yeah, you do. <laughs> when That's I, what you do. I mean, why would you? Even when say I was that? when I was nineteen, I had just moved to San Diego, and I had never been to a sex shop before. Oh. I was living living in a recovery home. This is like I wound up relapsing later on, and I heard about this place in North Park because the number two bus that I would go on would drive by it all the time, and it was a sex shop. Mm. And you know, when you're nineteen, you're in a recovery home. You're not really getting laid. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I was like, all right, when we go buy, I'll go to the sex shop and buy a DVD. Mm -hmm. Well, if anyone's familiar with North Park, it's, the sex shop's called The Crypt. Oh, yeah, what? yeah. I know exactly where you're talking about. And okay. it's a... Um, it's a gay... It's a gay <laughs> sex shop. It's like, and so, it's, like, it's like dirty, like, ball gag <laughs> shit in there. Oh, so like, I'm 19. Wow. So you fit in perfectly. I, no. Uh -uh. I'm 19. I go walking in. I start looking at things. And there's, like, a chick with, you know, a penis on one of the covers. I'll and take I went, two. <laughs> and I went... And I just put it down and went, okay. And I just walked out. <laughs> I was oh, 19. that's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> So that was my wow. first experience with a sex shop. I'm sure it is, and not your last. Yeah. <laughs> it gets confusing in there, I've heard. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, so it turns out that the authorities in Illinois uh, do not deem curbside sex toys as an essential oh, business That's right fucking now. rude. Actually, that is rude. I actually disagree. <laughs> so they shut them down quickly, and there are penalties for operating a business when they're not oh, supposed that, to. That is blah, a bummer. Blah, blah. Well, what we'll do what? Uh, is we'll find out if the crypt is open so Thor can still keep no, going. No, I'm not going to go back. Because right. he loves Perfect. it. I don't love it. <laughs>